Representatives of Japan and the United States signed an agreement on the development of the latest anti-aircraft missile glide phase interceptor designed to intercept hypersonic missiles. Japan and the United States plan to jointly create a new anti-aircraft missile that will be able to withstand hypersonic weapons by the beginning of the year 2030. The budget for the development of an anti-aircraft missile is more than 3 billion US dollars. The Japanese government has already approved the allocation of about $480 million for the year 2024 for the development of a new missile. The country will undertake work on the development of rocket engines and propulsion system components. Recently, the technologies of hypersonic weapons in Japan have improved significantly. Strengthening their interception capabilities is an urgent issue, the Japanese Ministry of Defense said in a statement. Glide Phase Interceptor is a hypersonic missile interceptor development program implemented by the American companies Northrop Grumman and Raytheon Technologies. These companies have been working on defining the concept of the system since the end of 2021. The GPI is planned to be used for regional protection against hypersonic missiles moving at a speed of more than Mach 5 due to their interception at the stage of penetration into the dense layers of the Earth's atmosphere. These interceptors will be integrated into the Baseline 9 Aegis combat information and control system used on modern Arleigh Burke-class destroyers. The GPI missiles are expected to be launched from MK.41 VLS vertical launchers, allowing them to be used on both destroyers and Typhon land-based installations. This means that the length of the rocket will not exceed 7 meters and the width 1 meter. In the process of developing the GPI, Raytheon specialists plan to use components that have already been tested in other missile and hypersonic programs.